North Macedonia, located in the heart of the Balkans, is a hidden gem waiting to be explored. From its stunning natural beauty to its rich cultural heritage, this small country is packed with incredible sights and experiences that are sure to leave a lasting impression. Whether you're a history buff, a nature lover, or simply looking for a unique and authentic travel experience, North Macedonia has something for everyone. The country is home to historic monuments and museums, picturesque lakes and national parks, and bustling cities filled with lively cafes and shops. One of the highlights of North Macedonia is the ancient city of Okrid, located on the shores of Lake Okrid. With its well-preserved medieval architecture, historic churches, and beautiful beaches, Okrid is a must-visit destination for anyone traveling to the country. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button before we start exploring the best places in North Macedonia. That way, you won't miss out on any of the amazing sights and experiences that this country has to offer. So hit that subscribe button now, and let's get started on our journey through one of the Balkan's hidden gems. 1. Lake Okrid Lake Okrid is a large freshwater lake in the Balkans, located between Albania and North Macedonia. It is one of the oldest and deepest lakes in Europe, and is considered to be a natural and cultural treasure with unique flora and fauna, as well as significant historical and cultural heritage. Lake Okrid is a popular tourist destination, attracting visitors with its clear waters, scenic views, and historic towns. It covers an area of 358 square kilometers and has a maximum depth of 286 meters. The lake is believed to have formed around 4 million years ago. Lake Okrid is home to over 200 endemic species of plants and animals, making it one of the most biodiverse lakes in the world. The lake has an important role in the history and culture of the region, with settlements along its shores dating back over 2,000 years. The towns of Okrid and Struga, located on the shores of the lake, are both listed as UNESCO World Heritage Sites for their rich cultural heritage including well-preserved Byzantine-era churches and monasteries. Lake Okrid is also a popular tourist destination for its water sports, such as swimming, fishing, boating, and diving. 2. Lake Matka Lake Matka is a canyon lake located in the Skopje. It is surrounded by steep cliffs and dense forests, and is known for its stunning natural beauty, crystal-clear waters, and the many species of birds that can be found in the area. Lake Matka is also a popular destination for adventure sports, including kayaking, rafting, and hiking. The lake is part of the Matka Canyon, which is one of the largest and most beautiful canyons in Europe, and is also home to several medieval monasteries, as well as numerous caves that are open for exploration. It is located about 17 kilometers from Skopje. Lake Matka is surrounded by high cliffs and is fed by the Treska River which originates in the Skopska Tarnagora mountain range. The lake is popular for recreational activities, such as boating, fishing, and picnicking. The surrounding area of Lake Matka is designated as a national park and is home to many species of plants and animals, including endemic species. The Matka Canyon is also home to several medieval monasteries and churches, such as the Street Andrews Monastery and the Vrelo Cave, which is one of the deepest underwater caves in Europe. 3. Monastery of St. Nam The monastery is located approximately 30 kilometers south of the city of Okrid, on the shores of Lake Okrid. St. Nam is said to have lived in a cave near the monastery and to have built a church and a number of other structures in the area. The monastery of St. Nam is considered to be one of the best examples of medieval Byzantine architecture in the Balkans and is well known for its beautiful frescoes and intricate stonework. The frescoes in the monastery date from the 11th to the 14th centuries and are considered to be some of the most important examples of Byzantine art in the region. The monastery of St. Nam was an important center of religious and cultural activity during the Middle Ages and was also a pilgrimage site for Christians from throughout the Balkans. The monastery was damaged during the Ottoman period and later restored, and many of the original frescoes and architectural features have been preserved. Today, the Monastery of St. Nam is a popular tourist destination, attracting visitors with its stunning location on the shores of Lake Okrid, as well as its rich cultural and religious heritage. The monastery is open to visitors throughout the year, 
and offers guided tours, as well as opportunities to see the beautiful frescoes and learn about the history and significance of the site. 4. St. Jovan Canio St. Jovan Canio is a medieval Orthodox Christian church located in the city of Okrid, North Macedonia. It is situated on a hill overlooking the city and Lake Okrid and is considered to be one of the most important cultural and religious sites in the country. The church was built in the 13th century, during the height of the Okrid Archbishopric, which was one of the most important cultural and religious centers in the Balkans during the Middle Ages. The church is named after John the Baptist and is known for its beautiful frescoes, which date from the 14th century and are considered to be some of the finest examples of Byzantine art in the region. The church is built in the Byzantine architectural style, with a central nave and two side aisles, and is topped by a dome. The interior of the church is well preserved, and visitors can see the beautiful frescoes and intricate stonework up close. The church is also notable for its location, which offers stunning views of Lake Okrid and the surrounding landscape. St. Jovan Canio is an important pilgrimage site for Orthodox Christians and is one of the most visited religious sites in the city of Okrid. The church is considered a must-visit site for anyone interested in the cultural and religious heritage of North Macedonia and is open to visitors throughout the year. The site is well-maintained and offers a unique glimpse into the rich cultural and religious history of the Balkans. 5. Macedonia Square the Macedonia Square in Skopje is a must-visit destination for anyone traveling to the country. This iconic public square is the largest and most central square in Skopje and is known for its stunning monuments, landmarks, and fountains. From the Memorial House of Mother Teresa to the Stone Bridge, there's plenty to see and experience in the square. The Macedonia Square underwent a major renovation in the 2010s as part of the Skopje 2014 project which transformed the square into a more monumental and classical space. This renovation added a triumphal arch, a statue of Alexander the Great, and several fountains, making the square even more picturesque and memorable. Whether you're interested in history, culture, or just taking in the sights, the Macedonia Square is a must-visit destination in North Macedonia. Don't miss out on the opportunity to see this iconic square for yourself. 6. Samuel's Fortress Samuel's Fortress is a historic fortress located in the old town of Okrid. It was built in the 11th century and was named after King Samuel of Bulgaria, who ruled over the region at that time. The fortress is one of the many notable tourist attractions in Okrid, known for its well-preserved walls, towers, and views of the city and lake below. Samuel's Fortress was built as a defense against Byzantine and Norman invasions, it played a significant role in the region's history, serving as a military stronghold and a symbol of power for several centuries. Over time, the fortress has undergone several renovations and expansions, and today, it stands as a testament to the rich cultural and architectural heritage of Okrid. Visitors to the fortress can explore its many towers and ramparts, admire the views of the city and lake below, and learn about the history of the region through informational signs and exhibits. The fortress is open to the public and is a popular destination for tourists and locals alike. Whether you're a history buff, an architecture enthusiast, or just looking for a scenic place to relax and take in the sights, Samuel's Fortress is definitely worth a visit. 7. Bay of the Bones Museum The Bay of the Bones Museum is an archaeological site located in the Prespa Lake region of North Macedonia. It is a unique open-air museum that showcases the remains of a prehistoric pile-dwelling settlement. The settlement was built on stilts over the lake and was used by the ancient peoples who lived in the area around 3,000 years ago. The museum is named after the many wooden piles or bones that still remain in the bay and are visible above the waterline. Visitors to the museum can explore the reconstructed pile dwellings and learn about the daily life and culture of the ancient peoples who lived there. In addition to the pile dwellings, the museum also features exhibits on the local flora and fauna, the history of the region, and the archaeology of the site. The Bay of the Bones Museum is a unique and fascinating destination, offering a glimpse into the history of one of the oldest human settlements in the region. It is an important part of the cultural heritage of North Macedonia 
and is a must-visit for anyone interested in archaeology and the history of the Balkans. 8. Stone Bridge The Stone Bridge is a historic bridge located in Skopje. It spans the Varda River and connects the old town with the modern city. The bridge was built in the 15th century and is one of the oldest and most important monuments in Skopje. It is a testament to the city's rich cultural heritage and its importance as a center of trade and commerce for many centuries. The Stone Bridge is a well-known landmark in Skopje and is one of the city's most popular tourist destinations. The bridge is well-preserved and it has been renovated several times over the centuries to ensure its stability and longevity. Visitors to the bridge can admire its beautiful arches and intricate stonework and take in the views of the city and river below. The Stone Bridge is a must-visit for anyone interested in the history and culture of Skopje and is a great starting point for exploring the city's many other historic monuments and attractions. 9. Mavrovo National Park Mavrovo National Park is a protected area located in the western part of North Macedonia. It was established in 1949 and covers an area of over 73,000 hectares, making it one of the largest national parks in the country. The park is known for its diverse landscapes, ranging from high mountain peaks to rolling hills and dense forests. Mavrovo National Park is home to a variety of wildlife, including rare and endangered species such as the Balkan lynx and the brown bear. It is also a popular destination for outdoor recreation, offering opportunities for hiking, fishing, skiing, and other activities. The park features several well-marked trails, as well as a number of scenic picnic areas and rest stops. Visitors to Mavrovo National Park can enjoy breathtaking views of the surrounding mountains, explore the park's diverse ecosystems, and learn about its rich history and cultural heritage. Whether you're a nature lover, an outdoor adventurer, or simply looking for a peaceful escape from the city, Mavrovo National Park is a must-visit destination in North Macedonia. 10. Ancient Theater of Okrid the ancient theater of Okrid is a historic monument located in the old town of Okrid, North Macedonia. It is one of the oldest and best-preserved Roman theaters in the world and is considered one of the most important cultural heritage sites in the country. The theater was built in the 3rd century AD and has a seating capacity of over 7,000 spectators. Over the centuries, the theater has undergone several renovations and restorations, and today it stands as a testament to the rich cultural and architectural heritage of Okrid. Visitors to the theater can admire its impressive stone architecture and take in the beautiful views of the city and lake below. The theater is also used as a venue for performances and events, making it a lively and vibrant part of the city's cultural scene. Whether you're a history buff, an architecture enthusiast, or simply looking for a unique cultural experience, the ancient theater of Okrid is a must-visit destination. It is a symbol of the city's rich heritage and a reminder of the enduring power and influence of the ancient world.